Hi everybody, welcome to Informatica videos. I'm going to show you how to create a profile in Informatica Data Quality. The agenda for the video, this video is going to show you how to create a joint profile inside Informatica Data Quality. And we're going to have an overview of data and joint profile and a hands-on demo. Uh, the purpose of this video is to show you how to create a joint profile inside Informatica Developer. Data profiling is a technique used to analyze the content, quality, and structure of a search data. Data profiling is often the first step in a project, and you can run a profile to evaluate the structure of data and verify that data columns are populated with the types of information you expect. Once having a data profiling, the joint profile is a way to perform a joint analysis on the data searches to view the joint conditions of each profile. Uh, in the example that will be shown, we will perform a joint analysis on the web bookstore and web bookstore clone data sources to view the joint conditions. Let's go to the demo. Okay, so using Informatica developer we need to click on new profile and select the option enterprise discovery profile let's name it as profile x oops profile x and just just click on finish button Okay, you can see that the profile X was just created. And now let's select the search data we are interested in generating the joint profile and drag and drop it to this part of the Informatica developer. Now let's click, let's press the control button and with the right button let's se let's select the option join profile so let's name it as join analysis profile x we can see that the two data objects that we've selected here are already uh, identified and you can see the columns that were selected among these two data sources and here it is important to add a join condition, which in our case, it's going to be the column book ID. And then let's click on finish. This message will be presented because uh, the profile won't be generated unless we save the changes that are being applied. So let's select the yes. And we can monitor from the progress tab how is the profile generating going. So let's wait a little bit until we see that it was executed and save it. Let's say, okay, it was generated. And you can click here on join result and you can see how this specific example of join profile was created. So on the web bookstore we got five rows, on the web bookstore clone we got five rows and the join took three rows from each table. And so this is an example about how to create a join profile. And we would love to hear any feedback from you at one of these channels, our Twitter or our email. Thank you.